Sam Rakesh. I'm from Transition IG3. We are a project that is newly formed that is looking to make Seven Kings of Goodmaze a more environmentally friendly place to live and a place which is better for communities. Uh, the project that I would like to show you today is a pedal powered edutainment project. And the idea is to show people how different appliances consume different amounts of energy and therefore so that we can make decisions as to what kind of appliances make sense to use in this current paradigm of ever-rising energy prices. So people can make good decisions about different devices and therefore save money and also help the climate. So what I've done is I've built this pedal-powered generator and the idea is I can generate energy using this and we'll use this to teach people very, very tangibly how different appliances consume energy. So forgive the noise, this is going to get a bit noisy. Uh, but as you can see, as I start cycling, I can generate electricity just by turning the motor. And you may be able to see these lights here are now starting to charge. And these are LED, really efficient LED lights, which basically I put in the hallways. I'm going to stop cycling for a little bit just to explain this. So I use these in my hallways. And every time I walk past, it senses I'm walking past and switches on. It takes 20 minutes of cycling to basically get these lights to work for almost a month, which is not bad. So not only do you get fit, but you get free electricity from a system like this. But I say this is not necessarily a practical thing that I'm expecting people to build for themselves. It's mainly just to show people how different energy is consumed. So I will later on build a way in which people can see how the difference between an LED light and an incandescent as well as a compact fluorescent light just to show how much difference each device uses. I can also use this to charge things like um, these Bluetooth speakers I've managed to just about produce enough energy to keep this projector going. So we've run a whole film night on uh, just on a bicycle. I can charge things like my bicycle light. And most importantly, I'm a reggae man, so I've got to have music. So my Bluetooth speakers are always charged using that. So just to show you, as I'm cycling... Um, this is enough to get these lights going, but if I switch on something that consumes more energy, all of a sudden, I'm really feeling that. I can really feel the difference between lighting these particular lights, on top of also lighting those, and it's really, really tangible how much difference it makes. And... Um, Yes, so the idea is to start having conversations uh, by doing these kinds of demonstrations. Um, but first of all, what we'll do is I want to uh, use, I, I'm looking to get some funding so that I can train five to ten local people from here in Redbridge how to build these kind of systems. Once we've built them, the idea is that they then go out to their communities, you know, uh, wherever they may be, um, perhaps different religious uh, places, uh, perhaps um, community centres, parks. I've already got good contacts with the library, so we'll be doing demonstrations there. And we will demonstrate, we'll bring these out to Redbridge so that people can actually try it out for themselves, so they can tangibly feel how much energy different devices consume so that we can then have conversations about your how much energy your mobile phone consumes your laptops your different music devices your kitchen uh, appliances uh, then talk about things like toasters and kettles and how much energy they actually consume um, 
So we'll be building several different types of systems. We'll be building systems like this, which just one person can operate and uh, can do these kinds of simple demonstrations. But we'll also build some larger systems, which can actually run really powerful cinemas, uh, which can also run really powerful PA systems, so music systems. We'll be getting some people to write some music, some lyrics, some spoken word, which means that we can then take things like this out on tour. We can take them to places which have no energy, and we can actually run events there, which will be pedal-powered. At the moment, my system here doesn't actually have a battery bank, so that's also the next thing that we'll be looking to do. At the moment, these just I can only generate energy immediately. I do have a power bank that I charge up using this, which I can then later on use to charge other devices. Uh, but as I say, this larger system that we're looking to build will have much bigger battery backup systems so that it's much smoother and you know we'll put some capacitors in and a few other things, other components that makes it just easier to actually run whole events. So if this is interesting to you, um, you know, who isn't interested in saving money, who isn't interested in keeping fit and, um, and being entertained, you know, so if you're interested in this, we need some support, we need some financial support to actually get this project off the ground. Some of the events that we'll look to do, it will be to, for example, as I say, take this to different community spaces, such as libraries and churches and what have you. We're also looking to organise a few bike rides. Uh, so we'll take people to some of the really most beautiful places that we have here in Redbridge. We've got some really lovely parks and forests and what have you. And so we'll be taking people out to places like that. And then at the end of it, we'll do either a, a music night or we'll be also be doing things like cinema nights. So we'll actually be entertaining people, um, educating people, getting them fit, getting them to see the beautiful spaces that we have here in Redbridge and most importantly having fun and meeting people and getting connected to people who really care and who really want to make a difference in this world. So if this is interesting to you, we'd really appreciate your support. Look forward to seeing that money coming in and look forward to seeing you out there on the road. I hope you're excited as this as I am. So hopefully see you there. Thanks very much.